Reluctant But Rewarded, written by Daksha Studios. Daisy the diesel rail car works hard on the Arsboro Harwick branch line. It is winter on the island of Sodor. Snow is on, on the ground. Daisy would happily spend the whole of winter in her shed if it weren't for Christmas. And she would, have, and she would happily spend all of January and February in her sheds if it weren't for Valentine's Day. Da the sta at the station on the branch line, the station master decorates the station for Valentine's Day. Daisy loves seeing it and loves seeing how happy it makes the children. Oh, I can't wait till Valentine's Day, said Daisy. The next day, Daisy was at the station taking on passengers. When she saw she was supposed to be coupled to a car with a cow. Oh no, I am not pulling that, said Daisy. She started off. Oh, Daisy, Daisy, said, said the station manager, the station master. Wait, you're supposed to pull the cow. I don't care, thank you. Sometimes Daisy does not like pulling things, and that's just part of who Daisy is. She was in a grumpy mood as she rolled along the tracks, and she delivered her passengers. She delivered all her passengers and was resting in Alfred Station. Oh, hello, Daisy, said Thomas. Oh, hello, Thomas. Aren't I splendid? Oh, but Daisy, said Annie, you didn't collect the cow. How do you know about that? Toby had to go from my branch line to your branch line to collect the cow, said Thomas. Thanks a lot. Oh, but Toby's more suitable for jobs like that, went on Daisy. Thomas rolled his eyes. That night, the next day, the next day, Daisy was at the station. When she saw she was supposed to pull a milk tanker, she was furious. Oh, I don't want to pull that. I do not want to pull that. Oh, Daisy, wait, said the station master. Oh, uh, what now? The people of Harwick need that milk. It's very important. They're running low at the grocery stores. Oh, that, then in that case, I'll be pleased to help my passengers. Daisy was reluctant to couple up to the milk tanker, but she knew the people of Harwick needed the milk. So she rolled along. Oh, I don't do well at pulling. My fitter says Daisy never ever pull. Pulling is bad for everything, said Daisy. As she rolled along with the milk tanker. Oh, but the people of Harwick do need this milk. And people need milk like I need diesel. So it must get to them on time. So she rolled along. She rolled into Harwick Station. Thank you, said a man. Thanks for the milk, Daisy. That is rightly appreciated by us people here at Harwick. Oh, you're welcome. Anything to help? That night, in Daisy and Ryan's shed... Oh, hello, Daisy. How was your day today? Oh, it was good. I had to pull milk, but the people of Harwick needed it, so I did it for them. I always please my passengers. And it's a good thing you did today. Or else someone else would have to take the milk. And why would the top man find it ended it on such short, on such short notice? Said Ryan. Exactly, said Sir Topham Hatt as he drove up to the shed. Where would I find an engine on such short notice? You, Daisy, are a really useful engine. 
said Sir Topham Hatt. Oh, yes, I am, sir. Thank you, sir. Yes, Daisy, you're really useful. And because you delivered the milk and pleased so many of your passengers and set and got the milk to Harwick on time, I give you the special special of taking the decorations to Har to to the station to decorate for Valentine's Day. Oh, sir, yes, sir, please, sir. Daisy loves Valentine's Day. So Daisy was Daisy was loaded with boxes and bags full of Valentine's decorations. And she rolled into the station. The station master unloaded them. All right, this is great. I love decorating my station. So he decorated and decorated, and Daisy watched as paper hearts were hung all over the station. The children will be pleased tomorrow, said Daisy, and she was very happy.